Hey, yeah. Well, good morning. Um, it is March 8th. It's a little after 7 a.m. And, um, oh, let me turn my light. That's not going to work. That first one never works. Um, crank it. Okay, so, um, I know I'm not doing this whole light thing, right? But whatever. I got the light. <laughs> um, day 39. And, um, I like to say, when I first started to come in this room, I was like, I don't got nothing to talk about. Let me see if anybody left me comments on my last video from yesterday. No, nobody's leaving me comments. Y'all not leaving me no comments. Um. Y'all not telling me how you feel. Y'all not watching. Ain't nobody watching this video. You you click and then you you leave. So whatever. I'm doing this for me, like I said. So I'm gonna keep doing it. Um, basically, uh, I saw a video. My brother sent me a video on Instagram about Dr. Seuss. So they're um, the the company. Um, Dr. Juice's publishing company, they are, um, there's six books that they're not going to publish anymore. And um, now it looks like if you have one of these six books, you can sell them on eBay or wherever for like $4,000 rather than the measly $14. Um, so, I don't know what books they are, but um, apparently they are um, racist, the books, um, because of the way that they depict different cultures. Um, I, the Dr. Seuss books that I have, I never had a problem with them. I feel like he just creates characters, and there you go. So... Um, boom boom and then um while i was looking at that apple news popped up at 7 13 and told me that um the senate passed the 1.9 trillion dollar package over the weekend but they narrowly passed it all i need to know is that they passed it i don't care about the narrow part um and then um, I wanted to talk about this video that I saw the other day um, because Oprah interviewed um, the prince and his wife, Meghan Markle. Meghan Markle. And um, before that, this guy, these, these guys, they managed to, I, it wasn't even a trick, like, I was going to say they managed to trick these different reporters into um, into doing like a pre-interview for the Meghan Markle interview with Oprah. Now, they had never seen the video, but they offered to give their points on the video. Like, how are you going to talk about something you've never seen? Now, I've never seen the video, but I'm not going to talk about that. I'm talking about the video that I did see where these people were um, just willing to talk about how the interview with Oprah went without even seeing it. So they had it all set up. They was paying them to do the interview and everything. And they just like bashed the poor girl like, it's just crazy how people, and these are like professional, um, these are like, uh, not professional, but like royalty experts. I'll put it, I'm going to put it right now. I'm going to put it in my, um, in my story, but these are like experts on, um, like all, all things royal, all things like royal news and the queen and the castle and like they're experts on this stuff so and and they um some of them 
actually do articles in the like majesty magazine and it's um i don't know just racism is is real all over the world like i'm not even gonna say that anything about dr seuss i don't think dr seuss is racist at all i think that he um he was working off of what he saw and he's making a story based on what he had seen and um yeah, I guess, uh, and it was only white people in the interview talking about how racist Dr. Seuss was. I didn't see, them, I didn't see them asking any Chinese people, and that's the things I'm talking about. Like even with the royal people, the experts, like you ain't ever talked to Meghan Markle. You don't know her. You just know uppity rich. <laughs> I don't want to be racist myself, you know what I mean? Um, but let me go to my, um, oh my gosh, Tiana Taylor's um, baby girl is so cute. So, I'm sorry, it's not even 7.30. I'm getting back in the bed. Um, yeah, this is like my day off video. It's probably not even going to be that long. I'm just going to... Um, post this video real quick and um yeah so <laughs> yeah i mean what do you feel how do you feel um about dr seuss how do you feel about um the interview with, with megan marco i think i'm gonna watch it i don't even know what it's what it's on like what what it's on um but i do want to watch it because I saw the tears in her eyes, you know what I mean? So there's some drama. So that means the interview was yesterday, I think. Um, but I put it on my story. And um, I guess my kids are really waking up. Amani was up. With my sleep. Anyways, this is my day off video. I'm not, I'm not really doing too much, but tell me how you feel um, about Dr. Seuss. Tell me how you feel about um, the Meghan Markle interview. Tell me how you feel about just racism in general. Are you excited to get that money? They passed it. The Senate passed it. And I think once the Senate passes it, that's like it, right? Like we're getting paid. I don't know, but I need some money and I know what I'm gonna do with that money. Oh, let me tell you this real quick. Quick little story time um, about Bitcoin. I made since November, December, January, February, March, since in four months, now, I'm not going to tell you how much I put into Bitcoin, but it was a little bit of money. Um, and I will tell you that I made $59 off of Bitcoin. I put, a I put a little bit of money. And out of that, from the difference from what I had then and what I had yesterday, I sure did empty that out because we needed some groceries. Um, I made $59. So that means if I would have put, let's just times it by 10. If I, I, if I would have put like some real money up in there. So I suggest when you get this stimulus, you put some money into that Bitcoin. You can do it. I did it through Cash App. Cash App. You can do Bitcoin and you can invest into the stock market through Cash App. Um, but, I mean, there's other things. There's, uh, I don't know, there's other ways. There's like this Coinbase app I keep seeing everywhere, but I'm not like endorsing it. I'm just seeing it all over the place. Um, for the stock market, I wouldn't, I'm not going on Robinhood. I did sign up for Robinhood and they were like, we need more information. And then that whole thing happened with GameStop or whatever. And I was like, mm, nah, bro. I'm, Robin Hood, no, I'm good. But I do have an account with Weeble. They need more information too. 
Um, but I don't know. It's something that I want to get into. All right. Um, but but yeah, I'm gonna put that money in because you know when the when the if there if you got harvest famine harvest fa it happens har harvest famine and I always know when I have the harvest that I need to put away for the famine but I be putting away the money for the famine and then using it in the pre famine and that's where I get messed up so I'm gonna put money away when this harvest comes and. Um, I'm gonna keep it away <laughs> keep it keep it keep it away because you know when the famine comes and I feel like this the next time around famine is gonna be for everybody so I need to, my harvest to well I mean this time the, the famine has been for everybody too but um, in, in a bigger way like so put the money away you can sell it and buy it and you know what I mean and but don't don't take it all out like I did I we needed groceries so um so yeah I think you should definitely um I think Bitcoin is is real I wouldn't put my whole check in that mug but hey do what you got to do with your money all right <sighs> My apologies for this video. Um, maybe tomorrow will be better <laughs> since we'll be talking about kids stuff. All right. Happy Monday. Have a great week. Be productive.